Welcome back. You're watching The Big Story. Now, let's tell you about the fact that Directorate General of Civil Aviation and the Center has come up with a rule book to deal with unruly passengers. Now, the new rules have been handed over to the Supreme Court as a part of hearing off on a plea of a woman on whom a male passenger urinated on board on an Air India flight in November last year. Now, three levels of misconduct have been identified by the DGCA. These include level one, unruly behavior, which consists of physical gestures, verbal harassment, unruly inebriation, etc. Level two of physicality, abusive behavior consists of pushing, kicking, hitting, grabbing or inappropriate touching or even sexual harassment. Level three of life threatening behavior includes damage to aircraft operating systems, physical violence, such as murderous assault, attempted or actual breach of flight crew compartment. Now, violation of these rules may lead to arrest and further invite a penal action on the offender. Samir, my colleague, joins me for the latest. Samir, good morning. The numerous instances that we've seen in the past, probably just one year, um, and considering you've also been reporting on that for us, do you believe that this was the need of the hour in terms of the key takeaways that one should know with this action that's coming through now? Yes, definitely this was a big question that what sort of rules or what sort of norms are there in case when there's an unruly passenger in the flight that causes inconvenience to the, not just fellow passengers, but, but also to the uh, cabin crew or even the pilot. And in that case, there, there's a hearing ongoing Supreme Court wherein, if you remember, last, uh, uh, last year, November month, there was a very infamous case where a male passenger allegedly he, he urinated on one of the female passenger. That case is still going on and in that case the female passenger came up with a, a, a point that there should be proper norms or rules that should be framed by the center or the aviation regulator in case of such unruly behavior so the center has applied to the court that uh, under the civil aviation requirement car rules there are a couple of uh, uh, rules which are already laid down and these rules mention that in case of unruly uh, behavior by the passenger in the flight, right. and he will be warned, and then there could be severe uh, uh, punishment like the arrest. So there will be so consequences of the same, like you are pointing out, Samir. I'd have to interject you there, but appreciate you putting things into context as to this was essentially the need of the hour. Let's leave it at that for the moment because.